We're going to talk about three different theories of self-disclosure in this chapter. The first of these theories is social penetration theory, which is sometimes referred to as the onion theory. This theory states that in most relationships, we gradually move through the layers of each other's personality like we peel the layers away from an onion. And as we get to know someone, we tend to engage in this reciprocal process of self-disclosure that changes in breadth and depth and affects how the relationship develops. So the breadth of information shared is the range of topics that we feel comfortable sharing with one another. So maybe in one relationship, you can talk to your friend about just about anything from politics to sex, whereas in a different relationship, you know that those kinds of topics are off of the table. And so each relationship that we have has a different range of topics, a different breadth that is acceptable to discuss within that relationship. Different relationships also have different depths. So the depth of information is how personal or sensitive the information is. And as you can see, there are four different levels of depth according to the chart that is on the tape on the page now. So on the very outside layer, we have the superficial level. This is the really surface level information that we tell just about anyone about. Um, so this is information that we wear on our sleeves that we happily and openly share with others. So that's the superficial level. And as our relationships develop, they often tend to go a little bit more deep. So we get into the more intimate information, the more personal information, and then finally, the more core information about ourselves, right? So we only let a small handful of people really get to know that deep, true inner self of us. And the social penetration theory also argues that people in a relationship balance these needs that are sometimes in tension. And these needs are the need for openness and the need for closedness. So we often want to make ourselves open to others through self-disclosure, but we also want to maintain a sense of privacy at the same time. And so these two needs, this need to be open and this need to be closed, are often in tension with one another, and it's pulling us in these multiple different directions. And the interesting thing about social penetration theory is that every relationship that we are in is going to have a dip different breadth and depth of topics that we can discuss. So there are some relationships that we have where we can talk about just about anything, but we stay on that really superficial surface level. And there are going to be other relationships that we have where we might not have quite such a large range of topics that we discuss, but the few topics that we do discuss get really in depth with one another. So every relationship that we have is going to have different levels and different layers that are open for discussion within that relationship.